Potatoes, are we, are we, are we on? <laughs> we might be alive. We might be okay. A new hand touches a beacon. A Anyways, new hand touches, hand a beacon. touches a beacon. <laughs> what up, everybody? Welcome back to uh, another episode of Emerald Lions. And uh, today, it's going to be great. Um, also, what happened last time? As I open the page. <laughs> no. Yeah. And then you T pose. Yes. So apparently to the quote Gerudo desert. <laughs> I see. All the sand. All the sand. Okay. So what happened last time, guys? Uh well we like we said before, we've managed to link up with Tamara over at Baba Yaga's place. We discussed the pricing agreements and whatnot. And we started gathering some supplies. And uh, apparently some huge amounts of tension started to pop up between Tamara and uh, Miss Mirage for some reason. <laughs> for what reason that may be, I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like something is up. However, this isn't really the time or the place to discuss this type of thing, as uh, depending on how heated the situation could get. Other people might get involved that don't need to be involved. But that's beside the point. Uh, once we finish mm -hmm. gathering our supplies, uh, we've decided to pick a route and wish to go to Drakion. Uh, I believe the overall, uh, the unanimous choice was to go to the quickest route, if I'm correct. Uh, yeah, through I the mountain. So. Yeah, through the mountain mostly because, you know, I'm quite the expert at going through mountainous terrain. And, you know, we heard there's a dragon there, and I'm also pretty good at, at dragon information. It's kind of one of the specialties I picked up in my, my bird village. Bird okay. village. <laughs> All right. So, we are going to tread through that direction carefully and as much as possible without causing so much of a ruckus to not to run into any uh, hostiles. That is the idea. Uh, but there is a large group of us, uh, and we don't really be, you know, causing too much of a ruckus walking around. So we should probably find a carriage or something. Lot of carriage. Uh, at least a big enough carriage to carry all of us, so that way we don't take up too much real estate on the road, and we're all staying in one place. Right. Shh. Free real estate. <laughs> All right. So, um, you guys are, I believe, still in town. Getting a getting a cart. So, anyone, just uh, give me an, an investigation check. I guess I could. So we finished up all our shopping. I'm just trying to remember what we bought. And I rolled an eye. And we bought. Then we bought a bunch of rope, and that my I bought. Well, technically, I think I... I'm not sure if I bought or stole, but, like, I do now just have a staff of booked bird calls. I, I remember saying I wanted to get an amulet of the devout. I'm just trying to remember if we uh, actually paid for it. I, uh, I yeah. believe I... I believe I paid for it. Anyone who gets to grab a bunch of stuff, so, yeah. Yeah. Alright. So mm -hmm. Noted. And I Should you add the staff of the bird calls? Every single day. <laughs> you Did you add the work. staff of the bird calls to my inventory? I have not yet. No. Uh, I could, I could grab. Uh, okay. We've also got a bunch of new potions. Whoever grabbed those. I don't have mm -hmm. any of those. I think I gave them. Those, I think I gave those to NPCs. NPCs. <laughs> well, I... uh, right. Keep gonna have to manage that if I have no clue what to do there. Brain. <laughs> Okay, uh, except for the bird calls, I will put that in there, because I have to keep getting something sometimes, but, like, I, but, yeah, um, 
do 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 um we add inventory to yours. Okay. There you have it. Okay. That comes to much. Okay. Dungeons and Dragons or Dungeons and Drips. So investigation. Yeah, they haven't found any dragons, so I guess we would do Dungeons and Drips. I will roll investigation. Unless okay. someone else already did. I rolled a nine. Uh, Tiffany got a nine, I think. All right. Well, I'll roll. I'll roll mine. My, my eyes see all. I have a twenty. Well, nat twenty. Oh. I hear rolling, so I'm gonna roll anyways. Your eyes see all except for money, it seems. Twelve. Well. Can you guys hear the bot? <laughs> hear the what? Not I what? I disconnected it. Oh. There we go. Wait, is it? Okay. But yes, um, 24 investigation. So you, um, managed to find a, uh, place with a bunch of carts in it in town. Preferably, like, right, like, next to the, to the gardens. And you see a little, you see little cobalt waves. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Yes, hi, how are you doing? Uh, we're looking for a rather large and sturdy cart to go to Fair Mountain Passage. You wouldn't happen to have one of those in stock now, would you? I have two of them. Large Ooh. for them or large for us? A uh, large for specifically uh, people that are bigger than cobots, if you have any. That's my yeah, 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 yeah. I have one of those. Okay. Uh, may we take a look? Yeah, 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 come, come, come inside shop. He's just like, he's like very like excited to have customers over. <laughs> Is this a new cobalt shop? The new cobalt shop, yeah. It's good cobalt shop, yes. Um. Time needs Vinny. Vinny or Jenny? Vinny. With the V. Oh, uh, Vinny. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. So, uh, how much, how many people do you say would be able to uh, fit inside this cart, including, say, supplies and whatnot? Yes. <laughs> yes, as in. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so I'm just going to assume that all of us can fit in it with all of our gears and whatnot, correct? Yes. <laughs> also, Reiki, why is her name just R? Oh. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> because R. 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 <laughs> Words. All right. Well, <sighs> if that is the case, uh, how much would be for the... Uh, for the cart in question. Time. And, uh, hmm. And, for uh, cart. Does it come for cart, yes. One hundred shinies. Mm. Uh, <coughs> define shinies. Uh, are, are we talking gold? Yes. They hmm? yes, they are talking about gold. Like shinies. Shinies. Okay. Uh, we can do that. Now, is this a permanent purchase, or is this more of a rental type fee? Rental, 100 Chinese. 400 for forever. Hmm. Hmm. That's actually not that bad. Now, does it come with, uh, does it come with horses? Mounties, yes. <laughs> okay. All right, uh, that sounds good. Uh, and would you say that the condition of the cart would be able to say withstand, say, uh, I don't know, uh, ambushes or maybe some rock slides or something like that? Sturdy, big cart. Yes. Um, is the cart open air or enclosed? 
Open air. No roof. Is you gonna like you gonna like show the cart? He's like, cart mounty. Would slap roof of the car to show how much ba horsepower this baby can pull, but you know, no roof. <laughs> Would it be possible to say have a uh, uh, a covering or a roof of some kind? Tarp. He says he's gonna like tarp. He, he grab tarp and he's like he's gonna go and grow, uh, like slowly like um pull some carp. He's like a little bit heavy for himself. <laughs> like. Big tarp. And then you're like, on the floor. Uh, Zen, do you think this will do? Um, yes, definitely. Okay. And mm -hmm. how much for the top? 50 shinies. Okay, so the total that we're looking at is 450 shinies. Yes. Oh. All right. Uh, we're going to be gone for a while. So, yeah. Sounds like a uh, pretty decent deal. Uh, anybody have any objections to this? Having a card is always a benefit. I have no objections. Anybody else? Hey. Jackson's just going to make a different bird call than an eagle now that he wields the staff of bird calls. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, if it seems like there's no objections to all of this, then uh, let's let us go ahead and pay for this. Shiny, shiny. His eyes Google, and he's like his hair, like his his tail is like swish is swishing. He um, this cobalt's like he's like he he's a green cobalt. Okay, so Biggie's gonna rummage through his coins and stuff and pull out the. I tap them on the shoulder. Oh. I. I pull out a Jasper. <gasps> and some of those children's toys that we got a long time ago. Oh. Nick Knacks! Yes. Shiny. Shiny and Nick Knacks. Give me. <laughs> I will give you this Jasper, which is worth 50 shinies, a whole bunch of knickknacks, and then we give you some extra shinies on the side. Ooh. How does that sound? Um, give me persuasion with advantage real quick. I did. Advantage roll was 27. Oh. Oh my. Okay, um, he, he his eyes boogle. He's like, yes, deal, deal, shiny, and Nick next. He says, and I got us a bit of a discount then. Okay, so how much do we owe now? One hundred shinies. Still. Uh, don't worry about that. I I can okay. cover that much. All right. All right. So that'll be up. up. Three pounds of knickknacks. Here we go. One hundred shinies. Oh, he's just yeah, basically he's just gonna like he's gonna like put the uh, cause he he's he grabs the, the shiny the, the the gold and the like the jasper and the knickknacks put him in uh, go over to the counter put him on the floor and he just starts gonna like swimming in them shiny with the rest of the with the rest of the like, this gold like pieces that he has imagine yes. you know how Scrooge mm. McDuck has that big pit of gold coins that they swim in in yeah. the kobold <laughs> Perhaps. Except they have to wear a hard hat to every time they jump. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. He's just, he's just, 
giggling afterwards, and you guys got the cart. <laughs> okay, well, now that we secured the cart, uh, now that we secured the cart, let's go ahead and start loading things up. I just mm -hmm. load up my box because it's the literal box of holding. <laughs> All right. I blame the DM for giving me a box of holding. Who does it? Who does it? <laughs> um. We all fought over that you... thing, only for me to be the only one to get one. There's a lot of uh, <clears throat> other fish, fish on the sea, right? get a bag of holding and throw it in there, then we'll have ourselves a very fun time. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, no. Man with sometimes, sometimes I regret the decision, sometimes of weapons in there. If I could spit those out, dear god, that's gonna be fun. That would be a hell of a shrapnel of sorts. Wow. Well. Alright, so I guess we're just loading up the cart at the moment. Yep. Yep, you guys are loading up the cart. You know, we can store a lot of the stuff in my box of holding and literally save ourselves time every time. And space. Oh, uh, space. Maybe you guys can do that, but I like knowing where my things are at all times on my person, so, uh, y'all can go ahead and store your stuff in the box if you wish. Yeah, no, I'm on Figgy with that one. Uh, kind of have to be on the quick draw every now and then, you I'm know, not, especially just being weapons, in the forest, so surrounded by like, territory. Or... Thing like food or such. Like, okay. Or, you know, excess gear or random stuff you intend to sell. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, y'all can handle that. I mean, you don't really need to have your, uh, random stuff, like, Oh, I have all this here, uh, these here gemstones, like, what good are these gonna do me in the fight? I mean, you could toss them at someone and hit them in the eye with it. Also, I think you're the only one who carries around that many gemstones. Why would you use a normal gemstone to throw at someone when you can hit them with a rock you find on the ground at your feet at all times? I mean, Disrespect. Look, do, do I roll to see if I just pick a, ro a rock off of the bed of the goddamn cart? Just, sure. just to prove that there's just always a rock there somewhere. <laughs> and it feels like a perception check to, to find a rock. 19. Oh, 21, really? 19? Technically, it's well, 21. Pretty good. Plus two. You, 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 you find a pebble. See? There's always a rock. <laughs> the rocks are watching you. <laughs> Wait, why do we even entertain in this conversation? Look, you can store your... Yes. Everyone else can use the box if you want. Just like I can use the box if I want. I'm just choosing not to use the box right now. Yeah. What is it about the box? Is... <laughs> the box is holding. Basically, and then the storage unit for miscellaneous items that we come across, then we're just gonna keep it in there if we don't need it. I am now Which realizing is... what would be a fun sleight of hand magic trick if someone doesn't know what the box you is wanna holding. You wanna see a magic trick? <laughs> someone oh. doesn't know what the box is holding, and someone really big climbs in and just appears into the box. Oh no. Anyways. So I was like, anyways, uh, let's, let's cut daylight. So <laughs> she's just, like, basically, she's just, um, has her, uh, like, gun, like, squished over her shoulder a bit. Ooh, and hops in. Get in, loser. Get in, get in, losers. We're, 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 we're going adventuring. Who are you calling losers? In a loving way. She's like, oh. I think he just looks at, uh, I'm, I'm assuming Tamara said this. Mm hmm yeah. He just looks and just starts to think, you know, I understand you're trying to be, like, relaxed and everything, but even that was a bit out of character for you. I don't think I, you ever caught anybody losers. 
Was it Tamara trying to be hip and cool? I know, hip right? It's cool. weird. <laughs> Sh Shade says, well I, well, I thought I was, uh, I was cringy. See? So at this point, everyone's just trying to have their uh, modern day moment. Hmm. Isn't today um, the modern day? Yes. Always. The tea. Okay. Anyway, yeah. Are we all set? We're all set. Six, yes. Yeah, Six gonna be flying above the cart, keeping an eagle eye out. And uh, during the uh, first hour of travel, I would like to short rest to attune the amulet of the devout. I'm just declaring that now. I'm also probably going to do All a right. short rest to... I feel like I have something I should be trying to recover, but I don't know what. Uh, wait. I don't have anything to recover. Never I'm on mind. short rest. Long right? rest because for what I'm thinking of, because that would be the side of chaos and side of magic. Never mind. Uh... Well, if we're going to be resting and stuff, I guess I could just play a... Wait, will Song of Us even do anything at this point? I don't think any of us is taking damage, so... There is too many people who talked at once. Sorry. Uh, Song of Rest would only... I think Song of Rest would only help if someone rolls a uh, hit and die to recover hit points. Mm-hmm. That was just asking what Song of Rest does in the first place. Yeah, it's basically that. Whenever you roll hit die to recover hit points during a short rest you can if the bard is playing they can you can recover i think it's a d6 or d8 hmm. well, extra me, well for me i should have song of rest by default mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so let me look real quick yep it's a d6 uh but my Base uh, hit points may actually cover whatever health I'm missing, technically speaking, if I even need to use that. So, if anything, I'll probably just need to use like a short. I'll probably just take a short rest just to get my body exploration back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, I think that'll be it. And by short rest, I mean, uh, well, actually, I'll just I'll play it out as we're uh, riding along the passageway and stuff, going towards the destination. So, uh, does anyone have any cards? Um, Shay, just text up, text up some. I got some. Don't take this the wrong way, but you were actually the last person I expect to have cards. I, I, I took up, um, I took them off Nikki, so. It was just, it was just a thing nearby. Oh, yeah, they're Tifo thing. You just stay in the air. You know what? That makes sense. Yes. Uh. Okay. <laughs> uh. What kind of cards are those? Uh. They're like. What's they call it? Um. They're just regular playing cards. So I guess uh, anyone up for a round of uh, poker while we uh, travel along the way? Test our bluffing skills or whatnot. Uh, claim like I hit I gabble yes Jesus. Aren't you driving the cart? No. <laughs> Where's the highest right. animal handling? They should be the one driving the cart. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. My animal handling is a plus six. Mine's a plus I have five. A plus, I have a plus three. I'm plus four. But I'm flying, so I can't okay. drive the cart. I mean, I'm happy to be the cart driver. Someone else, if no one else wants to be. Okay. I guess I guess we'll be taking shifts driving the cart then. Yeah, that that's fine too. That was our card. Yeah. So what did they say theirs were? Mine was five. Uh, I'm a plus four. Oh, I'm a plus five. Of of the players. So wait, I have better I'm... animal handling than you do. Yeah, I didn't take proficiency. Funny enough, the mm -hmm. first Pyrarch I ever played actually did have animal handling proficiency, so I was ended up being the card driver. Interesting. I don't have proficiency either, but I do outclass all of you by one point. Oh. What? Of course. 
Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, unfortunately, I exist. Uh, we exist in a world where animal handling oh. is a wisdom skill, so therefore, mine is automatically pretty good. <laughs> yeah, mine is too because right. I'm a ranger. To be fair, it, it is it, rather it, important. Yeah, it's all, it, it's offset by the fact it's that poor. um my, my stealth is horrendous, so. <laughs> If we're ever asked to make stealth checks, just assume I'm going to fail sight unseen. Yeah. Oh, we have kind of mentioned that. Uh, so yeah, the ranger, would... the ranger can bail us out with the uh, pass without trace to get my my negative one with disadvantage to something that might pass. I do actually have pass without trace. Wow. Uh, I can also just stick you inside the room of the rope trick, which is a fun little thing. It's fun. <laughs> Strictly speaking, I also could just prepare and cast invisibility on myself, but where's the fun in that? Yeah. Plenty. You could just be loud as hell, but invisible. Strictly speak, speaking, Needle, the invisibility Needle, would only counteract the disadvantage, so I'd still be rolling straight. I'm pretty yeah. sure. I'm pretty sure if I had a way to make myself silent on top of it, then I could just walk past. Stealth checks without rolling. Mm-hmm. Okay. Would you think they're gonna take two uh, concentration slots? Well, technically, like, there are potions of invisibility you could use. No. Right. And I don't think the invisible the silence okay. spell travels with you. I think it's on a point. Hold on. All right. Yeah, no sound can be made within or pass through a 20 foot radius sphere. <laughs> and I don't have point to choose. Thing. So, no, it couldn't travel with me, fortunately. There, there is also the irony of silence, which prevents the usage of spells with verbal components itself requiring a verbal component. <laughs> Well, yeah, you oh. need to tell someone to shush. Or else. <laughs> Alright. So. <laughs> if you guys are traveling. Um. Basically, you're uh, you're he- you're heading out uh, from Yoro, mm-hmm. and there's a ro- road at first turns into this forest, well, uh, heavy forest of trees and bushes, and uh, it goes from scarce to like heavy. Um. As you do that, and then and you guys are relaxing, and uh, whoever is driving is driving. Um, everyone, give me a percentage check. Actually, no, first D one hundred, and then first percentage check. Uh, let it be known. I'll roll the D one hundred. Maybe my luck is good. Oh, if you want to, sure. Uh, I would want it to be known that uh, oh, they have fifty one. That's not bad. Uh, I do have natural four of the uh, forest and mountains. And has an hour passed yet, for clarity? Yeah. Okay, so I'd be out of my short rest, which means the amulet of the devout is now at home. Alrighty. 17. And um, Jackson 17. has an own, I guess. Uh, 30, 20 for a figgy. Oh. Admittedly, oh, I would be a bit terrified 25. if a 27 and a 25 were not enough to detect something. <laughs> oh, sorry, my college friends were like, oh yeah, there's a stalker guy that's been following me. You know what, I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. <laughs> I really <laughs> hope that that person is, st- is safe. Yeah, they 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 are, they are safe. They're in their house right now. But they're like, are we gonna pull up? I'm like, right now? No, I'm out. I'm playing D and D. 
<laughs> I mean, uh, you know, we we can schedule like when we're gonna pull up. All right. So everyone, let's see. So, let's see. Let me check the thingy. Um. Okay. So, everyone. Uh, they're just chilling, and you you just he uh hear a little bit of like a creeping, little scattering sound in the um, around you as it gets dark. Um. Figgy. Yeah. So, uh, Figgy and Pick. And let's see. Let me check. Zens. We have a 27, right? Yeah, that's a, it's a natural 20 for a 27. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then... You can tell that there's a glittering of... spider eyes. A group uh, of them surrounding the cart. Jackson just sort of licks his lips. <laughs> they comically... With my... Natural 20, can I immediately tell if they're just observing or waiting for the right moment? They're about to ambush all. <laughs> okay. Can I <laughs> pick any out clearly in a crowd, from the crowd? Yeah, like, which one looks like they'd be the biggest uh, controlling one out of them? Um, the one that's basically uh, a little bit farther away um and uh how close are the nearest ones the nearest ones are about 20 ish feet from you are any of them about 50 feet in the air <laughs> no. i have been flying this entire time <laughs> no they're 20 feet from the cart yeah I'd love to cast... There, there are a lot of spells I'd love to cast. You know what? I need to make a impression. I need to make a good first combat impression. How many of them could I theoretically catch in a 20-foot radius? Um, Probably like three. They are about to ambush us. And yeah, what about a uh, 40 foot radius? 50 foot radius? Let's see. Oh, wait, that doesn't get damaged. Never mind. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was about to say, like, okay. All right. You know what? How about a. Uh... Let's go with this. Um... Yeah, we're back. getting ambushed. Ambush, yes. or rather, we're ambushing. Um, <laughs> this is right, yeah. I roll my initiative. How many? I rolled a nat twenty for initiative. We haven't rolled initiative. Yet. We're just we I'm just gonna cast them. third level all lightning. Okay. They so, need to do. Um, can I? Well, can I specific? Because I can see the eyes, I can gener I have a general idea of where they are, right? Mm hmm <laughs> Um, all right, then I'm going to target the bolt at one of them and it's and any within five feet of the origin point must make a dexterity saving throw. Okay. Dexterity saving throw. Let me grab the spider. Spider stat. <laughs> I am a spider. Make a deck save. Okay. If chitter chatter. Chitter chatter, cl clitter clatter. Uh, okay. Deck save. We're having roasted spiders. At the pass. Today. At the pass. And was that the only one caught? Uh, just. Two of them. Alright, so... Is that a roll for both of them, or are they rolling individually? Uh, roll for one general one. Okay, so they both pass. This is still half damage. 
Yeah, I'll okay. take that. Okay. Actually... Sorry, I know this is out of character and a little bit flaky. So you know how you mm -hmm. renamed yourself to R? Yeah. The first person in my friends list is now N. <laughs> is this some kind of trend or something? Because now two people are doing it. And neither oh, of them know no. of each other. Alright, uh, you, you know what? I, I, I'm going to spend a channel to build channel divinity for a destructive wrath so that role is hey. now a 30 half to 15 okay so that's 15 damage uh 15 lightning damage oh god dang it mine okay. broke too now it's p oh <laughs> it's not a trend um no no it's okay, so our accounts are breaking Thanks, Discord. Oh. Yours is R, wow. theirs is N, mine is P, and Life Casters is L. Oof. Alright. So, it is at this time. Alright, so you just... uh, two, The two of them explode into gunk and lands on the cart itself. Oh, no. Huh. Everyone, now give me an issue. <laughs> I'm sorry, oh, the idea. I am sticking 14. with my nat 20. I'm not re-rolling it. This is mine. You can't take it from me. <laughs> I'm sure the DM can, but like, I don't think the DM wants to. Oh, there's my 9. My nat 20. Well, it's still faster than me. Ten. <laughs> I I'll, I'll put on the table, as, as, as far as Claire's, my Claire characters go, I'm not used to rolling better than most of the rest of the party, more or less. RNG hmm. plays no favors for no man, woman, or child. RNG, Jesus Christ, knows no mercy, only probability. I, I mean, I, I do hope I get to roll a, a initi zero initiative, because I can do that. Okay. That is hilarious. <laughs> Every time it happened in another game, in the other campaign I played a cleric in, it was all just funny. Hooters. Hooters. Okay. So, Tim, I got a nat 20. <laughs> For a total of 23. 23. Okay. Uh, Figgy got 9. And then Pit got eight. And then Zen got... Uh, okay. Zen got a four, two. Okay. Got it. Okay, and then NPCs. Let me just roll them. Just generally. Six. <laughs> Six. And then Spooters. Fourteen. Oops. Fourteen. I'm guessing Zen goes be before the Spooters. Okay. okay. Um, if they have a positive Dex mod, they actually move before me. Oh, that's a plus. It's a negative. Two. Yeah, I'm a negative oh. one initiative. Okay then. Um, in that case, all right, if not, it's your turn. You see, uh, up ahead, you see, uh, well. Some, uh, spooter eyes. Spooter eyes. As I start playing some music. I'm so spider guts now on the cart. <laughs> so we just got a bunch of spooters? Yep. Mm -hmm. How many? Okay. Uh, you will see right now. I'm, I'm about to put you guys in... Oh no, this is... 
Um, Suddenly, I'm very glad I cast the spell I did. I'm also glad I'm 50 feet in the air. <laughs> what is this, Aragorn? Is that the spider's name? <laughs> when we Aragorn. walk into Hagrid's backyard. <laughs> I have so many options for this. <laughs> Best part is, they'll probably group up and become more optimal to go away with Paul Lightning. Well, <laughs> I'm going to be using a fourth level spell slot. Mel. Okay. Minute, uh, melt Minute Meteors. Oh my! my favorite spell slots or spell to use. Oh. So, I get two uses of this. So, we both know what this does. It creates six meteors around me, and I can expend mm -hmm. one or two of them as a bonus action. And on this use of this, I am able to use it. Uh, immediately as well for one or two meteors. Also, okay. as I used it as a fourth level, I get more meteors. By that, I mean I now have eight. Eight meteors. Yep. Okay. So, for two meteors, I'm going to send two of the one of them here. And another one here. Since we okay. have AoE, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, each creature within five foot of the point of impact would be... have to make a save or be taking the damage. Okay. I'm putting the meteors over here. Okay. So... Once meteor reaches destination Four, or an impact six, and you its purpose, seven. it explodes. Each creature within five feet of it make, must take a dexterity saving throw, uh, mm -hmm. which is dexterity 14. Okay. And uh, on, on a failed save, One, they take two, the full 2d6, and on a save, so 1d6. So all of these right here. <laughs> Pretty much. Okay, that's gonna be four, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten of wait, yeah, ten of ten of them. So, so for the first one, I'm rolling two d six for their damage. So that's six. Uh huh. So all of these ones over here have to roll okay. a dexterity above fourteen, or okay. they take six damage. Uh, 19, 21, 23. Well then, successful rolls 20, will be half the damage, so if they're successful, they still take three damage. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nope, nine. And ten. All right, cool. So there's three fails. Looks, like, looks like seven of those take three damage, and three of those take the full six. And All right. for the second meteor, okay. Two d six for the damage of the second meteor, and I rolled a three. Oh. And that one is this meteor up here. So. Okay. That would be covering these two, it seems. Okay. Cool. Um. So that's gonna be those two. Yeah. Right. Free Shavakadu. Oh, look at them. Come on. Okay. Alright, so 
So it's going to be two of them. Let me grab. There we go. One. Two. And three. Well, I guess just one two. Go. So they all pass. Would they take one damage? One and a half. Or do we round up to two? Oh, one. One. Okay. Well, Only one? Oh, they face a big, big. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, Well, now there's two freighters, and I have six more meteors that are all bonus actions for the next turn. I don't think we can yeah. call the three a crater. Like, maybe the six, but the three is like a, a dent. A dent, yeah. And I'm sorry that we are taking the opportunity to kill them with fire. Your turn. Oh, wait, no, it's the spooters. <laughs> oh, right, but remember, uh, Bob Magic us? Search. Oh, yes. Okay, I'm gonna roll the d20 to see if it's odd or even. Uh huh. And it's even. Okay. Which that happens. Was it even or odd? I think you should write that down. Evens. So, which one causes the wild magic surge? The evens. Okay, then. Rolling the D100. Please tell me I don't turn blue again. 75. 75. Let me... Let me... Let me... Let me look at the thing. Um... Uh, Somebody tells me this is bad. 75%. Uh, game rolls... Yeah, we go. Uh, sorcerer... Yeah, slight sick. All right, so seventy-five. Uh, you said okay. Uh, you glow with bright light in a thirty-foot radius for the next minute. Any creature that ends its turn within five feet of feet of you is blinded until the end of its next turn. Okay, so I suddenly become a flash <laughs> in the <laughs> middle of it. Just. Flashlight, here we go. No, no, not flashlight. Just, I, I become a flashbang. Just... <laughs> Mind Everyone's you, the only blind. things within five feet of Tivna are allies. <laughs> I'm blinded! Ah! My eyes! They gotta end their turn, so they're good right now, but I do recommend you get out of there. She's like, oh shit, who turned out the lights? And then, like, Clay's like, what the fuck? Oh, did we all and get flashbanged? Like, oh, we all got yeah. flashbang. <laughs> God damn it. Whoa. I am outside of the range, like, even from the 30 foot, but, like, I just look no. down and there's just a bright light on the ground. I'm just like, God Bro. damn it. <laughs> God, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's like, then also, like, it's kind of like a blind. No, not the blind. <laughs> oh my God. I know, uh, I know, uh, a perfect thought for this. I don't even think I'm affected <laughs> by this flashbang, so I'm just like, what's going on? <laughs> like, I, well, I you don't can think tell I'm you're affected. obviously bright as hell, but you're not going to be blinded by it. Blinded by light, the song. <laughs> da -da -da -da. <laughs> okay, now it's the Spooter's turn. Okay. Uh, a lot of move. Okay, so let's see. Uh, this, these spiders are gonna look at you. They're gonna start climbing on here. <laughs> in this, in this, or at least try, try to at least they get surround the. <laughs> they go on top of Piggy. One, one go on top of Piggy. I don't like this. Figgy is blind and he can feel a big hairy leg. music going on, and spiders. <laughs> I became a flashbang, and spiders are crawling everywhere. There's nothing about this I like at all. I don't like any of this. No, I hate it. I hate every <laughs> single ounce and second of this bullshit. I hate everyone. <laughs> <sighs> they jump like a jumping spider. <laughs> they start the cart. Oh no. Don't worry, I've got a plan for this. <laughs> they jump to only make them tastier. Um, they're just gonna surround the card. 
<laughs> they climb out of the crater like the fuck. They get to line up. These ones are like waiting. <laughs> so, there we go. All right. So the one. Okay. So. Uh. Okay. So the one survive figgy one two, three or is gonna hit hit him. Let me grab the stat skin because I just. Stats, stats, stats. There we go. How many are near exactly? Two? There's like... Four. <laughs> I hate every single ounce of this. <laughs> <laughs> For as Figgy, right? I, I might have a solution, yes. but it's, depend on, it, it's um, dependent on how much AoE damage people are willing to eat. <laughs> <laughs> so, A does not hit for Figgy. No, does not 20, hit. 22 hits. That hits. Um, a 7 does not hit. No. Double 7s, too. That's actually kind of funny. 17. Uh, 17 matches. Okay, give me a con save. Out of curiosity, why are they rolling at advantage? Like, why is it bot rolling oh. at advantage? Uh, I'm only choosing the first number that 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 I see. It's just it's just that um, it's just it's this computer. It's weird. Uh, all right. On save. Here we go. I believe in you. Does the fourteen do anything for me? Uh, fourteen are good. You're not poisoned. Woo. Woo. Oh god, being poisoned would be absolute hell. Do you, can you I... see the uh the damage? I cannot. Mm -hmm. All I see is the word damage. Same oh. here. Okay, hold on. Damn age. Damn age. <laughs> <laughs> it's a num It's probably some number between zero, no one and a lot. Uh, okay. One D three. I posted what basically my character has done. Okay. In uh, general stuff. Oh no. <laughs> Plus three, and then the poison. And then a d4 poison. Is the poison to half with not getting poison condition, or does he, does he still take the full poison? Oh, uh, it's just half the poison. Yeah. Okay. So that is, okay, uh, that's one bite, and the other bite. Um, yum, yum. Oh, no, thank you. You're full course meal. How could they do this to you? <laughs> Don't you joke about me like that, goddammit. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... Uh, seven, and then... Uh, half of nine, which is... Five. Four? Four, five. Seven. <laughs> yeah. So I got poisoned by two different spiders. Fortunately, poison doesn't stack. Oh, yeah. It doesn't. It doesn't they're like, um, um. <laughs> uh, that one went, that one went, and that one went. Now, the one near, this nearby Tivna. Wait, uh, before yeah. we do that, uh, the two no. that attacked me, uh, our reaction will trigger at this point. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, animate tel telekinetic energy. When you take damage from a creature within 10 feet, you use your reaction to force that creature to make a strength saving throw. Okay. I think you only pick one of them, though. I'll take the one that did the most damage to me. Okay, uh, it's this one right here in the middle. Okay. <clears throat> I just want it to be launched right over Zed's head. <laughs> Mm, tasty. <laughs> All right. So what's happening with the reaction? Uh, strength saving will... throw against spider. Oh right. Strength saving throw. Thirteen. Okay, it does not make it. So it's gonna take uh two d eight force damage and be pushed ten feet away from me. <laughs> not... it's just... Okay. It's a it telekinetic wise water. It takes 11 damage and it gets the fuck away from me. Okay. Does it does it knock over to the other one? 
Let me see. I'm just now imagining just the spider explodes <laughs> off in one yeah. direction. Just like... 11 force damage. Okay. Just pulls an 11. Just freaking... It, it bumps into this one. It, it, it bumps into the other one. And then this is like, hey, watch it. <laughs> uh, the one near... Uh, the ones near by Zen are going to uh, attack. So there's going to okay. be three of them. I need to write down how much health I actually just lost. Did I recover any health from the short rest? Yeah, you uh, do. Yeah. Uh, as many hit dies you rolled, plus I'm presuming you would have taken the Song of Rest die since it's free on top of it. Mm -hmm. Alright, so let's just assume it's 63 because that's where I started. So I'm going to roll a d6 real quick. All right, cool. We take six. So that's number one. Eight, 12, mm -hmm. six. And now the hit die. Uh, where is that at on my sheet? Am I dumb? I feel like I'm being dumb right now. No. No, I'll just hit. I'll hit short rest. Mm -hmm. And um, get rid of that. Uh, hit die. Uh, I'll roll a single hit die. <laughs> <laughs> All right, twelve. Twelve. Um, pretty sure that means I'm full. Yeah, you're full. All right. So now let's do the actual math that matters, which means how much damage did I just take? So um, there was seven at uh twelve. Uh, say that's uh, eighteen. Twenty. Uh, yeah. <coughs> mm. Woohoo! All right. So wait, it's it's six, and the two d four, five. Count the uh, cut that in half. Round up. That's three. So that's nine. Then it's another seven. That's sixteen. Mm. And then it's nine. Count the, uh, so twenty one damage. Twenty one. Twenty one damage. Yeah, here doing math. Yep. Yeah, here doing math and stuff. All right. All right. Pulls out the abacus. I the one. Yo, if someone ever pulls out the yeah. abacus in real life, they, they are a danger to mankind. <laughs> do not, right. abacus, do so, not mess with their money so, if they do that. They will. They will literally so, chuck you off a bridge. So three. So so three of them are gonna. Uh, other three of them are gonna like attack Zen. <clears throat> All right, bring it. Twenty-two. Hit. Nineteen. Hit. And fourteen. A uh, miss. That's oh. con saves, though, right? Yeah, it's con saves. Three of them, please, or two of them, actually. Technically, it's four because I'm concentrating. Okay. Yeah. That's right. Uh -huh. Oh, uh, roll the poison ones first. Yeah, because you need okay. to know the damage before you can roll for the other one. And I'm assuming a 20 passes. A 20 passes, mm-hmm. And I'm assuming a 6 fails. Yeah. Oh, no, you're poisoned. No! It's okay. it's okay, the life of a cleric is making everything else make saves. <laughs> Okay, so a six. Uh, you take the full poison, so that's four poison for the first one. Six for the piercing damage. Yep. I don't think that damage boosts it far enough to increase the save threshold, at least. Yeah, no, it's a DC 10 save. Five, yeah, 18. I'm good on the first one. And then... I'm just gonna go ahead and roll the second one, beca one because I seriously doubt giant spiders can deal 22 damage in one attack. Yeah, they did 9 this time. Yeah. I need to pass anyways. So... That's 11... So... Let's see, 10... The, the, the D8's for the, the piercing bite damage, and then the D4 is the poisoned. 
so. Where did, wait, what, why are they getting a plus one on the first? Oh, sorry. Uh, also, technically, I only failed one of the checks. I don't remember. But then again, I don't remember if spiders are safe, of, safe to avoid or if okay. poison's built in. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. Not for the concentration of the spell. Well, I already passed both of them. Uh, so okay, I'll just make good. it easy. And that's 18 damage overall, I believe. Yep. Okay. Yep. So then only it is my turn. And uh, then these three spider, the last one on the back. Oh, yeah. They're gonna try to bite Shay. <laughs> Shay looking like a snack. Um Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? Mm. Okay. Uh, one hits. <clears throat> Eight piercing. One, <laughs> one poison. <clears throat> She's gonna do a concentration saving throw. Oh God! I remember that she has a constitution of like three. There you go. Well. That's something. Something done goofed. Done goofed. Goofed, goofed, for goofed, for goofed. Okay, sorry. All right, so it is okay. So uh, she's poisoned. So and um, okay. Also, I have to go. <laughs> That's when it's Zed's turn. Hello. Hmm? Yeah. I'm yeah. Sure. Um, yeah. So I have to go somewhere anyway. Okay, then then I will do the cleric thing and speed the uh, combat up a little bit. I'm gonna ca I'm gonna cast spirit guardians. Okay. Spirit guardians. So yeah, every every design non designate every spider must make a. All the spiders are going to have to make a wisdom save. Wisdom save. All right. Is it gonna be the general? Well, I've been done. I, I'm almost done. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Um, wisdom save. Yes. Okay. This is, this is gonna be for all of them. Okay, that's a fail. So let's see how many we can get at once. Uh, it's gonna be twelve radiant damage against all, everything within every spider within a fifteen foot radius. Okay. That's gonna be twelve uh, damage. Yep. Mind you, some of these spiders are just blind because they I think they're turned five feet from Tivna. <laughs> yeah, they're blind. Oh, yeah, there's that. So Not that it matters is... in the context of a uh, wisdom save. Yep. That's it. Um, yeah, it's a wisdom save for that's a nine. How much damage? Well, At twelve damage. Uh, yeah, it's total damage centered, and the radius is centered on myself, so let me just... Okay. So you... S yeah, so you see all these... Oh yeah, there's also this one. This one as well. Yeah, that one would get its toe grazed. <laughs> yep. Alright, if so... I'm able to... I'm gonna hop out of the carts. Mm-hmm. 
Is this is this tile considered difficult terrain? Yeah. Okay, so okay. it's probably yeah, five feet to get out. So ten. Mm-hmm. Fifteen. Mm-hmm. Twenty-five, and I'd provoke opportunity if I went any further. So. I'll leave it up to you if they okay. they have to eat damage if I move move if I move I'll pull the radius onto them. Uh I would say that would be a wisdom save really quick. For them. Oh, a fresh wisdom save for the four that are out caught. Fifteen? That meets should I roll fresh or should the twelve carry over? Uh D twelve would carry over. Alright, so six damage to all of them and Oops. Six yeah, damage? Should, I don't think six should kill a giant spider. Okay. Six. Alrighty. So one of those was previously hit by the uh, damage of six meteor. So. Yeah. Just yeah, so that one. But, but I don't believe it'd be the one that would... I don't believe it would be this one, so I didn't uh, no. opportunity. No, it would be this one. Okay. okay. Alright, noted, and... Okay. I'm gonna call my turn there because right. the magic of spirit guardians is anything that enters the radius has to make the save. On their yeah. turn, have to make the save. So yeah, okay. So as as you uh, do that, uh, basically how you flavor your your spirit guardians, they just come out. Yeah, I I would think it'd be like just a the forms of like pseudo dragons flying yeah. around in the 15 foot radius that's cool that's really cool um everyone sees this as as, as everyone sees this um it's Figgy's turn but i have to call the session mm -hmm. noted um also before i forget completely for tomorrow make sure to level your character for that campaign up to two and you have one Uncommon magic item of choice subject to approval. Got it. All right, we'll do. All right, and uh, just for clarification, when did you want to record the line that you wanted me to say, or the script? Um, let's see. I was I was thinking whenever you're free. Um, I'm I'm about to do something right now, but like maybe like tomorrow. Um. Uh, or Friday. Uh, Friday I'll be busy. I can do tomorrow, but tomorrow it has to be done by like at least three o'clock your time. Uh, okay. Uh, I'll be I'll be be busy by then. Um, maybe next week. Uh, I could do Wednesday, but it but again it'll have to be like before. Uh, it'll be it'll have to be around the time that, like around like now was like the latest I could possibly do it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because next Wednesday I have to work. Uh, yeah. Monday is also Monday is also a good choice of a day. Okay. For like sure. Monday I'll be off. Yeah. Okay then. Alrighty. Um. Alright, guys. That's the session. Three, two, All right. One. Three, two, one.